A quiet street in the twinning community of Southeast seems straight out of a movie. There's flowers growing along the sidewalk and neighbors are out chatting with one another. But for some people who live in this neighborhood, they say if this is a movie, it's anything but sunny. She's a DC resident and mother. You have the American dream that you it becomes a nightmare and you become a prisoner. Your home should be your solace. With her back turned to the camera, she fears showing her face will only lead to retaliation. My house was recently vandalized. It was understood that I'm a part of the discontent. She isn't the only person that has faced revenge for voicing her concerns. I have been told to mind my business. I've been threatened. Local ANC Commissioner Patricia Howard Chittam says this is what people did to her car over the weekend after she says she complained about the behaviors happening on her block. These are people who don't even live in the community. You know, you also have to deal with public drinking, public urination, um, as well as some other illicit and illegal activities. She says these people are coming into their neighborhood to have a good time while also forcing out some of the people who live here. There's older people who've been here for a minute. There's gone, it was one family that was here for about 10 years and they were like, you know what, this is not getting any better. I can't sit here and wait, I'm gone. Has anything been done to deter the crime? Chittam says she's tried to make it happen as ANC commissioner. Looking at data from DC police, total DC crime is down 18% compared to last year, but Chittam says things have only gotten worse. They will mark it as a petty crime versus a, a much larger crime in order to keep the crime statistics down. And she says when crimes do happen, people are too quick to forget. And now all this neighborhood is hoping for is for someone to do something. I've let my my council and my mayor know and is as met with silence. I reached out to the mayor's office as well as the DC attorney general's office. As soon as I hear back, I'll update our WUSA 9 app in Southeast Colby Satterfield WUSA 9.